Welcome to the vlog YouTube. Today is my day off kaya meron akong time to go out and shoot. Pero before that, pag-usapan natin yung magulong weather dito sa Doha. Unti-unti nang umiinit sa tanghali pero sa gabi malamig pa rin. Kaya confusing kung magdadala ko ng pangginaw or just a plain shirt. Siguro early sign siya na winter might be over soon. And right now, malakas yung hangin kaya ang hirap din mag-shoot ng video. So probably mag-stay na lang ako rito. Palipasin ko yung hangin and sa gabi mag-shoot na lang ako. Pero tricky mag-shoot sa gabi kasi kailangan maliwanag yung area. Buti na lang meron akong lens na capable to shoot at low light kaso fix siya sa 50mm. Pero we'll see kung ano magagawa natin. It's also an opportunity to learn more about the lens. And welcome to the second episode of the Street Photography Series. Let's go! Tonight we're going to shoot dito sa Sukwak Yif, a traditional street market dito sa Doha. And right off the bat, sumalubong sa akin tong cube shape na building na saktong saktong yung pagkaka-frame niya dito sa exit ng stairway ng parking. Mahirapan ako yung compose yung photo dahil nga naka-fix ako sa 50mm and masikip yung area dito ng stairway. Kaya kailangan hanapin ko mabuto yung tamang angle and yung tamang distance from my camera to that rectangular opening ng parking. Not bad, pero hindi rin maganda. Parang meron ko lang eh. Kaya naisip ko na bumaba and look for a different angle. Pero hirap talaga yung lente sa mga ganitong space na masikip. Hindi ko mapalabas yung image na nasa isip ko nung building na yan. Buti na lang, nagkaroon ng subject sa gitna and it makes the photo a lot better. Now, paglabas ko ng parking, sinilip ko agad yung surrounding to see what's going on. And I noticed yung entrance ng parking na bising busy mga sasakyan na pumapasok. So, I stood here, waited and... I snap a photo. If you're into photography, matutuwa ka rito sa Sook dahil maraming mga interesting things na makukunan. Mga iba-ibang klaseng characters na naglalakad dito and yung mga iba-ibang klaseng taong nagtatrabaho. Marami pang mga corners dito na hindi ko na-picturean na looks traditional pero it blends well with modern life and I taken a lot of photos here some are good pero most of them are bad pero yun nga yung goal ko for the night to take a lot of photos hoping na makachamba ako ng isang magandang shot and masaya na ako dun Finding a subject dito sa souk will not be difficult. Those old men on their wheelbarrows caught my attention. They are called the Hamalis. Sila yung mga porter na nag-aabang ng customer to bring their goods to their car. I think they are the last of their kind kasi wala ka nang makikita ang batang Hamalis. Most of them are elderly. And it's sad to see na wala nang next generation na papalit sa kanila. Pero inspiring din na after all these years, Nandito pa rin sila, still serving their patron. Kaya salamat sa mga locals and mga residents ng Qatar na sinusuportan pa rin sila to keep their Hamali tradition alive.
Not easy to shoot at night. Kailangan mo talaga ng ilaw na katulad nito. Pero kung walang available tendency, i-adjust mo yung ISO para lang makita mo yung image. Ang problema doon, nagiging grainy yung quality ng photo o nung video. So, malaki na itutulong kung meron ka talagang lens na merong low aperture tulad nitong Canon 50mm. Uh, chicha sa mga beginner na katulad ko, automatic nagiging maganda kagad yung mga image na nakukuha. <laughs> Pauwi na sana ako kasi lumalamig na so as I walk to the car, I noticed this building and yung mga cars na dumadaan sa harap niya. So I ran towards that building hoping na makakuha ko ng one last good photo before I call it a night. So that was the night. I took a lot of shots. Most of them are bad, pero nakachamba ako sa tatlo. The first one is this lady na nasa labas ng perfume store talking to the guy that sells the perfume. Simple lang naman yung photo. Maganda lang yung pagkakasiluet ng babae sa frame. And it shows yung usual scene dito sa souk na merong vendor tapos meron ding mamimili. Second one is this car passing by this building. Kung titignan mo yung photo, simple lang siya, maganda lang yung pagkakailaw and saktong-sakto lang yung car sa center ng building. For a beginner like me, nakakatuwa na nakunan ko yung car exactly at that moment. Na first time ko lang makakuha ng fast moving subject na ganyang kalinaw. <laughs> and finally, my favorite photo of the night, itong Hamali Porter na nakatambay sa harap ng tindahan. Chill, chill lang, waiting for a customer to avail of his service. I like this photo kasi it shows yung true essence ng soup, which is old and traditional na hanggang ngayon nag exist pa rin in spite of Doha being a modern city. And maganda rin na ipakita na ito yung side ng Qatar na traditional na hindi pa rin nila nakakalimutan yung old ways. Like this Amali na it's been doing the same thing for over 30 years. Uh, tuli tuloy pa rin na parang hindi nag exist ang time sa kanya and he's keeping the tradition alive. I was surprised about night photography kasi intimidating siya. Marami ka mga bagay na iniintindi at iniisip just to get the shot. Kaya natuwa ako nung nakita ko yung mga images ko na magaganda naman. Well, at least in my opinion. Pwede na siyang pang Instagram. Kaya tuloy-tuloy lang ang practice. Lalabas pa ako sa gabi to take photos. Practice lang ng practice hanggang sa makuha ko yung diskarte sa gabi. At makapag-produce ako ng magagandang images ng night photography. And I hope you like some of those photos. And like this video. And if you do, sana mag-subscribe ka. Para see you again next time. <laughs>